I'm here today on Moms Every Day with Dr. Kevin Strong. He's a pediatrician at Pines Health Services and he's got a great idea about helping to reduce sugar for kids in our communities. So Dr. Strong, what is that idea? Yeah, so we've been working hard uh, presenting in the local schools, teaching kids about uh, overexposure to sugar. And one of the things um, that we can affect for them is the school meals. So we're specifically working on removing all the flavored milks from the schools, uh, chocolate and strawberry milk, and just having the white milk. It, it really adds up over the course of the year. For most of these kids, they're consuming anywhere from six to nine pounds of extra sugar per year just from flavored milk. So it's essentially, it's a diabetes prevention campaign and, a, and, a, and also a childhood obesity prevention campaign. So, so what are some other tips for school lunches that parents can kind of reduce sugar? Yeah, it gets a little trickier after milks because it kind of varies from day to day and we're going to be working on that. But uh, the cereal choices in the morning is one other sort of discrete variable. You can request the low sugar cereal only for your child. Um, Yellow box Cheerios is a good sort of uh, base mark low sugar cereal. Um, I get as asked that a lot. So if you want to compare your cereal uh, you could use the Yellow Box Original Cheerios. That's a very low sugar one. Great. Well, thank you so much. And it's great news for our communities that kids are going to be getting less sugar in their school lunches and in their morning breakfast. And if you want more information, you can visit our website at wagmtv.com and click on Moms Every Day. I'm Sarah Duncan for Moms Every Day.